as uh, HD SLR cameras, this is a Canon 7D from our rental department, as these have become much more popular in being used in professional uh, situations, we've had to deal with our clients' needs for professional connections and functionality uh, with what are consumer, prosumer cameras. One of them is that it's got an HDMI connection right there for its video output and uh, well for proper monitoring really need an HDSDI signal on set. So we looked around and we came up with this box from Blackmagic Design. Now there are several different brands and different manufacturers, but we like this one. Uh, you can see it's HDMI to SDI converter, and it's actually HDSDI or SDSDI, depending on what you send, send into it and where you flip the little dip switches there. Um, the, uh, this box, note it says 15 volt max, so I stuck that label in there, because it is a 12 volt uh, box, which is nice for running around on battery power, because this is a portable unit. But uh, if you put something like a regular 14.4 volt battery in there, when you charge these up fully, you get over 18 volts coming out of this. And what will happen, according to Black Magic, is this will just shut down. I mean, luckily it won't fry itself, but it won't work, and that doesn't really do you any good. So then we talked to Nebtech, and Nebtech makes this special battery plate. Now, uh, it's not just a battery plate, it actually has a circuit board in it that is, and you see it's just plugged right into the box here. Uh, this converts the power coming out of a camcorder battery, this particular one's Sony, but uh, you can get it for Panasonic and Canon and other brands, uh, that takes that 7.2 volt power out of this battery and turns it into 12 volts. You can actually see there's a little LED that's lit up right there. This is fully powered now. Uh, it's a self-contained unit. There, it works. And um, that way, the regulated power that comes from this battery plate, it's like 12.1 volt max, well within the 15 volt maximum range. Uh, and then the last thing I did for our rental department uh, was a question about how do you mount this. Now, I mean, frankly, you could take this thing and you could you could Velcro it somewhere, but uh, we wanted to have a solution for sticking it onto the camera securely. So we actually had to drill a little hole. This is a Zakudo Zot shoe, it's called, and uh, it's a hot shoe mount. You can see basically that little lip right there. Take the camera, you can go right, I'll face this way, right onto the hot shoe and just tighten that thing down. And then you're gonna go a short trip from HDMI there to there and output right here, signal in HD SDI. Now, if this is a little too close to your head for comfort or something, then uh, pull this off and we have this little adapter right here which these things are about $20, $25. Put right on here. This can slide back and forth on here. And then you can put this one on here and slide it around wherever might be convenient. Really gets it out of the way of your face and operate the camera comfortably. And it's just a nice little solution all in one. Or of course you can stick it on the, in your belt or something. Uh, but this way, proper monitoring for your HD SLR camera.